Welcome to my channel everybody. Um, Mel from Mel W Scrapping. I am here to bring you a, a layout that I'm about to pop together. Um, for, it's in conjunction with two things. So the first one is Scrapper Sketch number 40. This is Lisa's sketch that she come up with, number 40 sketch. And I'm going to do my take on it. It's a bit of a collaboration between me and my daughter. At the same time, I'm also going to be playing along with Scrap Timber. And for the whole of this month, every day, they're going to have a prompt so that when you do a layout, you can add something on that day to be put onto that layout. So, for instance, today is stitching. Well, I think everybody knows I don't stitch, so I'm doing faux stitching. Um, now what I've come up with here, <clears throat> I found some uh, beach photos from quite a few years ago of my daughter and my husband um, that I've just popped together. Now I've just started to get this layout organised because um, my daughter's been off sick all week, so I got her on one of her days at home um, to give me a hand, because now I've got the cold. Um, she's still sick with the cold, but I've got it as well. Um, to give me a hand doing some background. So, her interpretation of Lisa's sketch, we divided the page up into four squares. And then I ruled up two little squares, and then I said she could do whatever she wanted. So, in these two squares, she put close to my heart ink cream brulee. Uh, this ink, colour ink here, is the Distress Ink Uncharted Mariner. Excuse my voice because it just doesn't want to keep going. And the yellow that she's popped here was Mustard Seed, Distress Ink Mustard Seed. I can't find it right this second. So here she just ink blended um, with the foam blender. And here she got the paintbrush. She put some ink down on some packaging, got a paintbrush, got some water and just painted the ink on is what she wanted to do. Now, with the ink, uh, with the stitching, what I've done is I've just gone around the edge here with a stitch, and I'm gonna do the same here. Oh, she's also stamped, she wanted to stamp a sand castle in each yellow corner. So let's just put some more stitching on across here. And I'm doing this with the um, Uncharted Mariner as well. And I found a stamp that I had that looked like stitching. A ripper, let's use it. Okay, so I'm just going to do those two bits around there. <clears throat> then, I had some of this um, sparkly ribbon. It's actually packaging ribbon. Stuff that you put on, you know, presents and, and what have you. If you can hear my daughter in the background, she's just, she stayed home again. She went to school yesterday, she stayed home again today because the nose just got snottier and snottier. Um, and so I've told her all morning she's been doing schoolwork that um, was set on the um, laptop for her. Um, so she's been doing that. So she's just watching some YouTube, I think, at the moment. So I'm going to pop this bit around here like that. I'm going to do the same on this side. <clears throat> Square end. Let's go like that. moved on me tried to cut them square on the end and then I'm gonna go like so for that one and then I am going to I still actually don't know if I might put stitch marks across those yet I'm going to go like so, actually might, I kind of like that. Always 
close enough. Turn around. I've got so much stuff on my desk that needs cleaning quite badly. Now, some of these might get hidden, but oh well. I think I turned that around. Let's go across the middle. Very good with this rubber stamp, am I? When it's such a fine one, it's so hard to. I probably got the shakes. Okay, so let's go with that. Let's wipe that off with a wipe. Hope everyone's had a good Friday. Well, here in Australia, it's Friday anyway, so I'm saying it's Friday. No, it's Thursday. Oh, I'm wrong. Today's Thursday. God. Told you I was sick. <clears throat> right. Got those. Got those. That. Got our photos. So let's get that stuck on now. Today is Thursday. Thursday. Tomorrow is Friday. Hope everyone's had a good week then. And not been as sick as me. Not too bad. It's just all in the nose and the voice. Like... I've got not a sore throat at all, but my voice is gone. But I thought I had better bring you a video for Scrap Timber for the 1st of September. Alright, I'm going to go in the middle like... I think I had it about there. Let's go about there. So Scrap Timber is... Uh, something that's organised by uh, the Scrappy Sisters and Laura Alberts. They are all very good scrappers. Um, and I don't know if MK doesn't help as well. I will have people listed down below anyway that I can find it that are playing along. If I can work out how to work it all. Technology and me really don't like each other. So I'll do our best. I found a little crown. I just thought I'd put that there. <laughs> These tags I actually got gifted in a prize I won from a group, a Facebook group called White With One that I... My daughter is laughing in there. You probably hear her. I don't know what she's laughing at. I believe she's laughing. It's got to be a good sign. <coughs> um, I won a challenge from their group. And um, like that. I put this one in because it looked like waves. Well, they're both dotty about flares. You can see there, that's alright. Um, now, they are done like so. They can just sit there. Didn't cut that off properly. They can just sit there. I don't think I'll... I've got a couple of little elements that I wanted to, I just don't know if I'm going to be out of time nodding them or not. Maybe I just sit them there like that and put a, some tape there. So 
and some sea elements. Let's go like that. So add some metal elements. And I thought I'm going to put something in the little squares. up. Can't put a knot in it so let's go like this. Hopefully that can hold them. Okay, so I'll do the same up the top here. And do, might make the layout a bit sticky but should hold them. Just got a bit of a thing on like I don't need that. Off. Right, see if I can put these off. I just want them to jangle around on there. I'll make sure this is still recording because it has a habit of shutting off on me. Now let's go like this. There we go. Let's have a look. Yep, they're going to stay there. That's alright then. So, I'll just turn this over so I can get these off. Title to be this. Hopefully, they stand out on the background. I found a sticker that says At One with the Sea. I kind of wanted it to go like that. Yes, that's what I want. Now I had a camera. Let's put up on some tape. Like that. Now, put some little fishies on there. We could just put the blue whales on there. They kind of match. That's not very sticky. Oh, I wanted a sunshine, didn't I? Hang on. Put this sun gold sunshine in here. over here like so Here. I should add this little sand castle to match her sand castle stamp she did. So what else I've got? Sorry, I'm not very organised. 
I'm not very organised at all today. <coughs> oh, ties. Go there like that. But I wanted to do something for the 1st of September for Scrap Timber and their prompts. Right, and I'm just going to go like that. I'm just going to have the sun with that one. might do me. I think that's all I really want to put. I could put a little alligator there I suppose. These little swinging thing on him. Okay. Let's go put some gems on it. And I'm gonna leave it at that. Stitching on there. What else we could do? I could put some of those on there. Okay, I might put some of those on there. Where are we for? Today, oh, those ones. I could use of them. Also, sorry for mumbling to myself. I have to go with black, black with little. Right. So one thing I'm going to do first before I put the gems on to finish my clusters is. I've got a line of these little sparkly things and I thought I'll make another line and I'm going to cross like this. done that so it looks like another layer of paper well, not paper but I've got another line there like on leases so we've got stitching some packaging ribbon stitching and then a 
sparkly thing. Right, let's finish off our clusters. So you don't have to listen to my terrible voice. <clears throat> right. So we're going to go one, two, and three. No, I'll actually move that one to there. Actually, I actually might move that one to there. Right. That way, black is tie tying in with the title and the camera. That's how I'm telling myself anyway. I always finish off with three gems or three Nouveau drops. I don't, in fact, I was going to use blue Nouveau drops. Anyway, we're finishing off with gems today. Okay, now that's what we've done. So that is my layout done for Scrapper Sketch number 40. I think I might even stick those ribbons down because that's annoying me a little. Um, and my prompt for scrap timber. Now I hope everyone can get along and check out the prompts for scrap timber. It's just a little bit of fun to add to your to your layout. Like you don't have to do, and you don't have to do every day. Um, I possibly won't be able to do every day. There's no law saying you have to. <clears throat> and I'm pretty sure Katie and Jess and Laura will not be the police going around saying, you haven't done every day. Um, so I'll give you a bit of a close-up of you can see the background and the stamping up in that corner. Oops. Uh, that one down there. That My little square up there. And there you go. Put that into frame. Okay, so if you think that you like this layout and could do something different or wanted to do something different, press pause, take a screenshot and have a go because I don't mind you copying anything I do at all. Um, at the same time, if you wanted to go and check out Scrap a Sketch Facebook group or the Scrap Timber Facebook group for inspiration, you will find lots of inspiration there. Um, if you did like this layout, if you could give me a thumbs up, that would be great. Losing my voice. Um, now these two things here, I have used the Dotty About Flares. And you could go and visit the Dotty About Flare Facebook group for even more inspiration. Um, and if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. It doesn't cost to subscribe at all. Um, thank you to all my subscribers and all my new subscribers. Um, I will have everybody else listed down below in the description box that I can find that are playing along with Scrap Timber. Um, go and check them out. Give them a like. Subscribe because it doesn't cost to subscribe to them either. Shoot them a comment. Tell them something that you like about the layout because they may be having a bad week and you may like something and your comment might make them feel a lot better. Um, thank you to my daughter who actually helped me do the background of this. Um, it actually looks, I found the perfect photos to actually go with this layout. Um, so thank you to her as well. She's actually helped me out of quite a bit the last week or so with backgrounds. Um, thank you to everyone who is watching. And my brain doesn't want to work. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time. Bye for now.